distinguished ladies and gentlemen i greet every one of us wherever where we did according to the time and location where we did there and also we think we believe in when i already know namibi i'm an activist i believe in justice even when i know that when you stand for justice you stand alone no problem now what i can tell us for here now to analyze some major things where the problem where some of the protesters in this ongoing end governance protest they talk where then they chant majorly you understand and i feel those are the major their pains the reason why they have to come out the mass to come and protest so that the country can be okay number one and the major things they are chanting for one they said tunubu must go and their reason they say ever since tunubu entered immediately he entered life become very difficult for everybody every nigerian both rich and poor now everybody hunger and starvation become the number one priority of every nigerians People find it difficult to eat two square meal a, a day, not even care now, just ordinary two square meal. And those who could eat two, two square meal a day are those, you know, that are okay and they are by manage. Some people barely eat once in a day. Some people will eat once in two days. These are the major problems they are facing in this country, hunger. They're now, I ask them, what do you people think is the reason why things become like this? They say they are, most of them are pointing on the high inflation of uh, uh, fuel, fuel that the cost of fuel is very expensive and that fuel now they regulate everything for this life for well in existence because nothing nothing can come to the final consumers without transportation if a farmer do farm finish any fuel to carry in, in things waiting to produce come inside where people go buy and now patronize them you understand and the fuel is very expensive and our farmer needs fertilizer and other things mechanism you know when he go to do the farm work before the farm products go come at when he go go sell them and fuel they affect all those things so the farmer the cost of farming is very expensive therefore it and the cost of transporting farm products to the markets to the for the final consumers to buy is still very expensive therefore farm products become expensive so which is making everything to be expensive the same thing is applicable to every sector of production in nigeria be it people that produce drinks people that produce bread people that whatever name it everything they produce in nigeria transportation affects everything because of the high cost of fuel now they make me believe that this is the major problem that what they want number one is for the fuel price to return to 200 naira at least cooking gas to where it was before which was around 150 naira before buhari took over 2012 you know back when they were selling gas uh, a kg of gas for 150 naira that these are the major problem in this country and the cost of uh, electricity be now is skyrocketing not that we have light no light everything in the country is just messed up the nigerians are lamenting that the sufferness is escalated it's too much it's unbearable they can't bear it anymore therefore they have to come to the streets and protest many many complaints that they lay and they also say that tunubu must go that is what they keep chanting Tunubu must go. Tunubu is a bad boy. We don't need bad boy as a president. We need Akbabio to resign. He is the senior president. In fact, we need our seniors reformed. That is what all of them are chanting. We need our House of Assemblies reformed. In fact, all those people who are there, all those corrupt Kaba, all of them, we need them out of our government. This is what majorly they are chanting after their complaints. You understand? So that is what I said I should come and brief us hmm, in analysis. So today we are still going for the NSAS protest and when we are done i will still come and brief us about it though i will still be posting the video on my youtube channel because these days now i will have gone live but network is totally messed up totally bad they don't even allow us to go live so that is the height of corruption in nigeria everything went off all network nothing is working so we are finding it difficult to go live that is why majorly you haven't seen me live but i will take some videos over there and then come and post it so in case you are watching me on uh, youtube and you like what i'm doing you want to see more of my report just kindly subscribe and hit the notification button so that whenever i post you can be the first to get notified and get updated if you are watching me on facebook or otiko anywhere just do the same thing and mind you same name onya chukumezi no differ god bless you my people mm -hmm. is the dance of the spirit taking them more my brother wait till you don't know you don't know because he's senior you as now your grandmama now your grandpapa that's all the matter be my people one love